So we're going to be attempting to make black multicam. Uh, what I'm going to start with is a base layer of streaking blacks and gray. I originally was going to do black and brown, but every version of black multicam I saw online didn't have a dark brown. It all was black and gray, green, and sometimes like khaki. So that's kind of the color base I'm thinking right now. So far I'm liking it. All right, now we're on to the part that I don't understand at all, and that's the stenciling part. But I know I want this color um, in there. And I don't really have an eye for stenciling or painting, so this is definitely the part that makes me the most nervous. But I'm supposed to put a layer on like this, and then, then you add more stencils, and you do your, your last color, and it's supposed to come out looking sharp. So, fingers crossed. Fingers, that's my fingers. Cross them. So for the third layer, I really wanted to use one of like my sand color ones or even this brown that I got but um, it's supposed to be black camo uh, not woodland camo so I'm kind of thinking I'm just going to do the third layer in black again just to make sure that it's not uh, too bright of a pattern. Uh, we're gonna take it off and see how bad it looks and you know, hopefully this is just one side of it So I'm hoping uh, oh God, I don't know. All right, I'm I'm pleased with it now. We just got to roll over to this guy All right, both sides are done. Next portion is just going to be uh, revealing the whole thing. All right, here's the finished product. Um, I'm pretty happy with the way it turned out. Excuse my flashlight as a ring light, but I don't have a, uh, a ring light in here. And uh, yeah, I think, it, I think it turned out pretty good. You know, let me know if you have any ways I can improve or any painting tips. And, uh, you know, kisses and stuff.